guys, this is Nadia from Cognito Forms. Today, we're going to talk about Save and Resume. Save and Resume is a feature that allows users to save the progress they've made on your form and then pick up right where they left off later. The way it works is pretty simple. To begin, go ahead and open up your form. Next, go to Submission Settings and turn on Save and Resume. If you preview your form, you'll notice that it now has an extra button labeled Save. The Save button provides you with a link that takes you right back to your in-progress submission. You can copy the link directly from this dialog, or you can have the link sent to your email for later reference. Going back to the Submission Settings menu, there are a couple of different ways to customize this feature. The first thing you can do is set an expiration date. By default, users can return to the form as many times as they like before completing their submission. But if you want, you can also control the amount of time they have to complete the form before their save link expires. This period can be a day, a week, or even an entire month. The next thing you'll want to do is take a look at the email notification settings. This is the email that your users receive when they choose to have their save link emailed to them. You can edit the from name and address, the subject line, and the message. Also, if you have an email field on your form, you can set that field as the to address to pre-fill the email in the save and resume dialog. Lastly, if your form is embedded, make sure to select the Send Resume Links to Embedded Form option. This will ensure that your users go back to your website when they access their resume links. When you're finished updating your Save and Resume settings, make sure to save your changes. Now, after I start filling out a form, I can click the Save button at the bottom to get my resume link. or I can enter my email, click send, and receive an email notification containing my link. When I access this link, it just takes me right back to where I left off. Now that I've saved my form, my partially completed entry will appear on the entries page with a status of incomplete. When I submit the entry, the status will change to submitted. You also have the ability to manually update the entry status yourself, but keep in mind that changing the status of incomplete entries will cause them to be submitted, which could potentially send out emails or trigger integrations with information that may not be complete. By the way, if you want to view all of your incomplete entries, you can use the filter option to filter down entries based on entry status. Just select incomplete and then click apply to apply the filter. If you have any questions about save and resume, be sure to check out our help topic at help.cognitiveforms.com or feel free to send us a support request. Bye.